Hello, everybody. Have no fear. I am here. Jay Lanley back today with um, not nothing really exciting to be honest with you. More of just an update. What's been going on? Where I've been? Um, it's been well over two weeks now since I've done anything on here. Kind of trying to get back into the focus of this, and my camera is trying to get back in the focus of me. You see me? Okay. I'm a little scraggly right now. I haven't got a haircut in a while. I haven't shaved in a while. <coughs> As I almost choked to death. <coughs> um, yeah, so this is just like an update and a quick, 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 quick review of Hurricane Vapor. Quick review. Juice reviews are very boring, so I'm going to make this painless and everything just falls over. I'm um, in my old bedroom, um, my parents' house. I'm watching their dog. Um, I guess I'm saying, um... <laughs> My apartment doesn't allow dogs, so I'm watching their dog in their home. Well, they're out of town for the next couple weeks, so I'll be here for the next couple weeks, so you'll be seeing this strange background for a couple weeks. So that's what's been going on. I've just been adjusting to this house, and my dog's a little bit of a menace. Um, he's an old dog, so he's a lot of taking care of and a lot of looking after. He's just crazy. Um, you might see him in one video, because he might be bothering me in one of the videos I do. Right now he's sleeping, so we're good. Um, mm, stop saying, um, God. Okay, so, let me get all my stuff ready, and we'll do this quick, quick, quick review of Moon, uh, Moon Mountain. Oh my God, Hurricane Vapor. So, I'll do this quick review for Hurricane Vapor. Hurricane Vapor, real quick. I saw them in a review that Phil did, and um, I was like, wow, those look pretty good. He liked them. It's like, I like them, because, you know, I like everything that everybody else likes. Not the case. Um, Hurricane Vapor 375 gets you their sample bottles. 375 for a 5 mil bottle. A little pricey, but I understand it's a sample bottle. You don't want to make a lot of commitment and buy their 30 mil bottles, which are, I think, around 15 to 16 bucks. Um, so it's a good thing to try out some of their flavors. They're all 12 milligram, 50-50, that's it. You can't change the ratios or the nick strength on their sample bottles. I got papaya milkshake, mango milkshake, and um, vanilla sky tobacco. Vanilla sky tobacco, I'm not going to review because it was florally. I did not like it whatsoever. Um, so that's that. I'm not even going to put it on camera because it was atrocious. Maybe some of you will like it. Not for me. Um, I did get, uh, let's see, are we going to do it? No, we're not. Anyways, I'm going to try. Mango milkshake and papaya milkshake also. And those two were, they were reviewable, I should say. Five mole bottle, child safety cap. It's like most vendors sell. Uh, okay, and in here is, it's an Igo, what is this? The Igo L, 0 0.70 coil, 3.7 volt battery, Sentinel clone. That's how I roll. And uh, I'll take I'll take a few vapes and talk about it. Vapor, outstanding, rebuildable atomizer, huge airflow, of course. So you gotta have great vapor. It's a 50/50 mix, also. Throat hit, thumbs up on 12 milligrams. It's great. A little intense for rebuildable, but it works. Flavor. Creamy milkshake, definitely. Mango, nah. I've tasted better mangoes. I don't know what else is in there. It's just not the best mango. I get I get the milkshake part's good, but the mango part kinda kills it for me. It's like it doesn't go well together for my taste personally. The papaya milkshake now, I was putting I had that in here and I rinsed it out because eh. See, this is the papaya here. You can see how much I have left of that. More than half. And this is the mango. I quite enjoy it a little bit. The mango's a little, eh, like I said. The papaya tastes like there's menthol in it. Which I'm not a menthol fan. I don't know if there's supposed to be menthol in there, but mine tastes like there's menthol in it. don't like it. It's got that same milkshake taste, but then it's got this pungent menthol with papaya with. I really don't know what papaya tastes like, so maybe that's what papaya tastes like. I don't know. I like saying papaya, though. Papaya, papaya, papaya. Um, I'm a little 
out there today, but that's that. Anyways, those are two flavors um, that I'm reviewing for you and telling you what I think about them. Not for me, not someone I'm going to buy again. You can check them out if mango or papaya milkshake sounds good to you. Maybe you'll like it. For me, not so much. Prices for the 5 mil is 375 and the price is um, when you go up to like the 30 mil, it's not bad. It's 16, 15 bucks. I'll put the link below. You can check them out for yourself. That's a quick Hurricane Vapor review. I mean, that was three minutes maybe, if that. Um, and as far as the company itself goes, the shipping was fine. I have no complaints with them. The orders were easy on their website and all that good jazz. I keep talking with my hands today. I have this hand thing going on. Um, but I'll set that down because it's quite agitating my throat, honestly. It's going to want to fall over, but whatever. And I'll pick up my DNA 20 with my uh, KFUN 3.1. This is not a clone. Somebody told me this is a clone. I know this isn't a clone, okay? This is a legit KFUN. Don't, I'm not going to get into how I know. Don't worry. This is legit KFUN. Somebody told me that I got ripped off. <laughs> I get some comments from some people telling me I got ripped off. Are you sure that's the real thing? Yes, it's the real thing. Um, and I do buy clones, but this one was not a clone. This was got in, in a trade with a um, in a forum. A very good guy, Jeff. Um, so that's that. Anyways, this isn't a clone. I use this regularly every day. And I'm going to have a vape. I love this. I use my Moon Mountain Vapor Juice in here. Uh, sweet Mother of Mercury. Love it. 1.4 ohm at 11.1 .1 watts. I don't know why 0.1. It's giving me 4 volts of power. The reason I have this in my hand that I'm talking about it is because the next thing we're going to, not the next thing, but coming very soon, as soon as I can get my hands on it, is going to be a review of the DNA 30. I'm either going to get it in three forms. The Vapor Shark has come out with the DNA 30 version. I could probably get my hands on that very quickly. There's the Hanamons V3, which is a DNA 30, which is very nice. And the ZNA. Um, the ZNA from Zen. I don't know anything from Zen, but I've always wanted some of his pieces there. It's a beautiful piece. If I can get my hands on it, that's what I'm reviewing. It's odd for me because I don't usually buy high end stuff, but tax time. It's time to give myself a little something, a little treat. It's very expensive, but we'll get into that. I'm sure it's going to be worth it. We'll see, though. So those are next. The Aspire Nautilus is next. Bear with me as these videos will come out a little bit faster. There's going to be another break because I'm going on my honeymoon in the beginning of March for a week. So I'll be gone for that week. I'll tell you when that's happening. Next week, we'll have a review, a regular review, back to JL, JL, back to Jay Leone <laughs> reviews. Um, there's been a lot of shit going on with it, with my eBay stuff, and it's doing well actually. So, I want to thank people that have spread the word for me. Very much appreciated. Giveaway, the next giveaway is coming. I know I said it was coming sooner than it really is. Um, the Chiyu clone is what I'm going to give away. It's my Chiyu clone. I don't use it, and I'm going to give it to somebody who's going to use it, just like I did before. So, that's next two. And then, hmm, what else? What else? I'm sure other good things are going to come. It, I've got about three reviews lined up to go, and we'll go from there and just giveaways, and I'm going to keep shooting them out and whatnot, because i got to clear some of my stuff. I have a shelf that's overflowing, and i got to get rid of it. just can't have all this stuff. It's driving me crazy. But that's pretty much it. I'm going to cut it here. I just want to give you a quick update on what's been going on with me. It will be back to full force next week, and... Uh, I want to thank you all for subscribing, doing the finger points. Thank you all for subscribing. Thank you all for your feedback. Thank you all for your help. Thank you all for just being there. And thank you for those who appreciate what I do. I really appreciate it. And until next time, live well and vape on, guys. Take care.